My name is Buffy. I'm 28 years old and I live in Portland, Oregon. Okay, I need a bunch of stuff and all I have is mayonnaise and salt. So. <laughs> okay, we'll get this little guy. Do, do I need a bag for this? How much brownies are you going to make? Um, a pan. A pan of brownies. I think I have enough. <gasps> We're good. We're good. Let's get out of here. make some brownies. Here's what we've got. So I never make anything that's not from a box and I never make anything that's in a box either but we're gonna try this from scratch today. So we've got flour and sugar, the basics. We want to do brownies so we also have some cocoa powder and some Hershey's mix here and then for a fun extra little twist I'm thinking orange and ginger. I love chocolate oranges so Maybe we'll get some orange peels in there and just make it really spicy and good. So, let's get started. Oh! Ah! Oh, preheat the oven! Now, a true baker never uses measuring cups, so I'm not going to either. We're just going to eyeball it and hope for the best. Oh, that's kind of a lot. I've never made anything from scratch. We're going to want to add the chocolate part, cocoa powder that makes it chocolatey and brownie. Oh yeah, and we got one of the marshmallows. There's gonna be some fun little treats in there. But like what part are you making? Well, we're gonna mix up the dry ingredients. I'm gonna melt some butter, put that in here with some eggs, and I haven't planned much past that. This How are you gonna mix it up? What do you mean? Milk too. This is the milk that I grew up with. Uh oh. <laughs> um, let's give it a good little shake in there. I'm probably good. <laughs> Dip in milk. Keep it creamy. It's probably good. Right. Now we're cooking with gas. Oh. So I think usually it's like two eggs. <laughs> no! No, we're fine. Oh, that's hot. Yeah, you just put it in the microwave. <laughs> so we have the eggs and the butter. We have the dry ingredients here. Oh, we need sugar. It's gotta be sweet. Oh, wait. I bought sugar cubes on accident. <laughs> that's okay. It's all sugar. <laughs> that's not gonna work. Um, okay. <laughs> Okay, so can you just go over and tell me what, so far, what do you have? Like, what okay. are your... I have flour, cocoa powder, sugar, baking soda, baking powder, and then eggs and butter here. But first, I'm going to break the yolks. Oh my god, who's getting hungry? This will help to kind of like fold it all in together. ingredient also okay so I want these to be really fluffy and moist and delicious so I'm gonna add a little bit of mayonnaise a lot of boxed brownie recipes use vegetable oil to give it that like kind of like greasy moist yummy taste so we're just gonna add a little bit of mayonnaise which is essentially oil please Our help her Wait, oh it smells so bad no <laughs> it Botulism? Botulism, yeah, that's the one. Look at this, this looks just like brownie mix. Okay, so it's looking kind of pale right now. So we're gonna add some chocolate syrup. Okay, we'll <laughs> see about that. Yeah, it smells good. So let's add some 
zest. I want to add some orange zest so it's that like orange chocolatey taste. So we're just going to get some orange peel in here. And we're going to improvise. Just, I should probably put this on my Sanitation first! We want it to be really light, not big chunks, of, but we just need a little bit of the zest. So we're just gonna kind of zest it up here. I was gonna add some ginger too, but I'm gonna hold off on this for now. So this stuff is potent, so I think this is gonna be enough here. So let's just add that in. Perfect. I believe they call this folding it in, when you just tenderly and gently mix the ingredients. Oops. Um, these marshmallows are gonna be so good! It's in. And I think this is going to rise, so I don't want to fill it up all the way to the tippy top. We've got to even it out, kind of shake it up. Is it even moving? Yeah. <gasps> Oven is at 350, and I think I'm going to do like 45 minutes. So, okay, turn off the fire alarm. Turn up. Uh -oh. Okay, that's all settled now. So let's see what caused such a commotion. What are you doing? I'm opening a drawer. <laughs> I'm trying to find my toothpicks. <laughs> there they are. Okay. <laughs> okay. So a trick that I learned to see if brownies are done in the middle, you take a toothpick, and if it comes out all dry and not covered in goopy stuff, then you're good to go. So these are probably perfect. Let's cut in. You ready for this? I'm not. Are you? It smells really good. You have to admit. Ooh, cakey! The sugar all seems to have melted. I'm treating it like some sort of like lab specimen, but this is actually a delicious pastry, so let's dive in. You may want to keep that bottle of water out in case you need to wash it down. How are you feeling right now? Um, I'm really nervous to be honest with you. Well, it smells delicious. It's cakey. It does actually smell good. Okay. It's really mushy. Which is a good thing. Moist. Thank you, it mayonnaise. Does. It does. I... Okay. <laughs> it... <laughs> Come on. I'm not no. joking. Come I'm on. really not joking. No. What? No, it's really fucking gross. It. Why? There's nothing sweet about it. It's <laughs> really stale. Like it literally tastes like there's rotten eggs in here. How is it stale? It's fresh baked. The only thing. It's a brownie. You brand. try it. You haven't it's even a tried it. Fine, fine. I will. Here. Oh. He's being a drama queen. I'm gonna get a big old yeah, bite. Tell I, us what you think. My sweet tooth is just screaming at me right now. Let's get a. It's a little hard to um, <laughs> get a bite of it. Mmm, it's really moist. <laughs> it's a little earthy. <laughs> the orange. Oh, okay. Please help her. Oh, that's really hot. 